AccuVision's Luke Barron has a look at this year's squad. There were some growing pains for the Aggie men's basketball team last season. A number of freshmen were inserted into new roles and forward Wendell McInnes was lost to injury. McInnes believes all that will make the team stronger this year. Last year, guys, the freshmen, they got put in situations they've never been in and it was tough, you know, on top of injuries. But I believe that this year our strength is our experience and we're going to you know, come together and put out a good effort. We're very optimistic. We've got a great uh, ensemble of players and, and characters and just some good kids and I think anytime you have all of that combined you know you're, you're, you're looking forward to a special season. In order to have a special season coach Marvin Menzies says his guards will have to shoot more consistently. Well, I think our guard position is you know, one that there's a little bit of a question mark on how well we'll shoot the deep ball. I, I think if we do a good job of, of our shot selection and and hopefully that offseason will pay off for all those guys. But I'm optimistic with the leadership that we have at our position that they'll play well. Menzies' optimism runs throughout the team. Junior forward Tyrone Watson is excited to get the season underway and has high hopes for the squad. The goal is to be over 500 and to win the WAC and to get a tournament berth and make some noise in the tournament. That type of season is going to take hard work, which McKinnis says this team is ready to do. Oh, fans can expect us to just do the little things, you know, you're gonna, you're gonna take, out, take on the identity of the city, you know, hard working and doing the little things to survive, you know, we're just gonna, we're just gonna play our hardest, you know, no, no team is gonna play harder than we do. I don't take second place, so that's not what we work for, so definitely we set the bar high, so we gotta just make it happen. Hopefully, you know, everything goes the exact way it's supposed to go and we, we go right to the top, which we plan to do. Plans often change, but if the Aggies stick to their script, NMSU fans could be in for some madness come March. For Aggie Vision, I'm Luke Barron. And New Mexico State's home opener is this Saturday, November 19th, when they face UTEP in the Sonic Battle of I-10. It will be a big night for the Aggies, as they'll dedicate a brand new court approximately two hours before the 6 o'clock tip-off. If you're in the Las Cruces area, you won't want to miss that. Of course, if you're not able to make it to the game, we'll bring you all the action live on AggieVision. Visit AggieVision.tv for a channel in your area.